Hello, my name's Karen Kiriakou and I welcome you to Melbourne Symphony Orchestra's Jam for Juniors Online. I'm really happy that you've joined us because we get to play music together today. In our jams, we learn how to play our instruments alongside the musicians of the Melbourne Symphony Orchestra and we thank our principal sponsors, Emirates, so that we can continue our journey around the world. Today, we'll be travelling to Norway. The music we'll be playing is the Pier Gint Suite by the Norwegian composer Edvard Grieg. Let's firstly meet the musicians. Jennifer Timmons is playing the flute. Playing the bassoon is Maddie Neal. Rosie Savage is playing the French horn. Andrea Keeble is playing the violin. The cello is being played by Dan Smith. And Rob Allen is playing percussion. The song we're about to play is set to the music of a Scandinavian folk tune. You can sing along with me and hear the sounds of the different instruments as they play. You can download the words to the song by using the links below. <laughs> It's always good to warm up before we play music. Make sure you've got lots of room around you and then you can give your hands a good shake and give your legs a good shake, stretch up high and touch your toes and you can do that a few times to get all the wriggles out and then you're ready to play music with us. You can pause the video if you like while you do your warm ups. It's time to get our instruments ready so that we can play music together. Some of you may have made your own instruments or you might have other instruments at home that you can use. Or you can simply clap along with me or maybe drum on your knees. This is going to be my signal to make a sound on your instrument and this is my signal to stop. Let's try. <sighs> job. Now count how many beats. One, two, three, four, five. Four beats. Ready, go. Three beats. Ready, go. Two beats. Ready, go. One beat. Ready, go. Now some tricks. job. Edvard Grieg was a Norwegian composer and pianist who wrote the music Pia Gint to accompany Henrik Isbens' widely performed play. Grieg used lots of folk music from his homeland Norway in his compositions, which allowed the world to learn more about his country. 
Pier Gint was first performed with Grieg's music in 1876, and about 10 years later, Grieg took some of the highlights of that music to make two separate orchestral suites. Pier Gint tells the story of a man on the run. Pier had to flee his homeland, and while doing so, encountered many adventures traveling all over the world, from the Norwegian mountains to the deserts in Africa, before finally returning to Norway as an old man. Morning Mood is the first of the movements we get to play together, and you might even recognize this very famous melody. The music captures the beginning of the day when the sun rises and the birds sing. We're going to start by listening to little themes of the music, and at the end of each theme, we'll do a long shake on our instruments like this. After our little themes, the piece properly starts. We need to learn this pattern. It's a shake, a stop, a shake, a stop, a one, two, three, four. Now with the musicians. Also, be a few different patterns to play as well, so make sure that you're watching when these come up in the music. Let's stand up now, ready to perform Morning Mood, the opening of the Pier Gint Suite.
Anitra's dance is the name of the next piece. Anitra was the chieftain's daughter. She was a beautiful Arabic dancer and Peer Gynt tried to impress her. But far from being impressed, Anitra steals his money and runs away. We start playing Anitra's dance together with a big shake. After that, I'll count along with you and we can practice this together. Let's try. Shake. <laughs> with ones. One, 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 one. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. One, two. Our pattern changes to a one, one, and shake. Then the string players and the wind players have a little conversation. We'll listen to the strings and answer with the winds to the words Anitra's dance. Like this. One, one, and then we shake. Anitra's dance, Anitra's dance. Then a one, and then a one, and then we shake. Anitra's dance, Anitra's dance. There are three beats in the bar in Anitra's dance. One, two, three, one, two, three. So far, we've mainly been playing on beat one. Um cha cha, um cha cha. We're now going to practice shifting to the cha cha parts. One, one, one. Then we shake. Um cha cha, um cha cha, um cha cha, cha cha, cha cha, cha cha, cha cha. Now we're ready to play through the whole of Anitra's dance together. Let's stand up and get ready to shake. a bit of a start and stop activity for you. Music of In the Hall of the Mountain King is one of Grieg's most well-known pieces and describes a scene where Pier enters a dark cave. He then finds himself being chased by trolls and he has to run for his life, although he does manage to escape. 
A troll is a made-up creature known for being rather unpleasant and very, very mean. The first pattern is a one, then we wait, then a one, then a one, two, three. Try with me. One. A one. Then a one, two, three. There's only one main melody in this piece and you already may know it. Here's some words we can sing to the music. We are nasty little trolls, little trolls, little trolls. We are nasty little trolls and now we're chasing you. And when we put those words to the music, it sounds like this. We are nasty little trolls, little trolls, little trolls. We are nasty little trolls and now we're chasing you. We are nasty little trolls, little trolls, little trolls. We are nasty little trolls and now we're chasing you. As the music goes along, we'll play faster beats. But if we go too fast too quickly, we might just run out of puff. Let's stand up now as we perform our final piece in the Hall of the Mountain King together. We are nasty little trolls, little trolls, little trolls. We are nasty little trolls and now we're chasing you. We are nasty little trolls, little trolls, little trolls. We are nasty little trolls and now we're chasing you. We are nasty little trolls, little trolls, little trolls. We are nasty little trolls, now we're chasing you. We are nasty little trolls, little trolls, little trolls. We are nasty little trolls, now we're chasing you. We are nasty little trolls, little trolls, little trolls. We are nasty little trolls, and now we're chasing you. We are nasty little trolls, little trolls, little trolls. We are nasty little trolls, and now we're chasing you. much for joining us at Jams for Juniors Online. We've loved having you on board. 
feel free to explore the Melbourne Symphony Orchestra's YouTube channel for more videos and activities, and of course our other jams. The musicians of the Melbourne Symphony Orchestra help bring the music to you today, so let's give a big thank you to them. It's been really fun playing music with you today, and we hope to see you back soon at another time.